Hello, Henrico learners and families. Welcome back to Edflix. My name is Miss Fields, and I'm the instructional reading coach from Verina Elementary. I'm excited to be your guest teacher for this week's activities. This week, we are going to learn about the elements of a story, and today we are going to focus on characters. A character is someone whose activities, thoughts, and feelings are revealed in a story. When we are reading a book, we want to think about who is or who are the characters. For example, if I am reading The Masquerade Ball, the character is going to be the mouse or the mice. If I were reading the book Jabari Jumps, there's a main character in this book and the main character would be the boy Jabari. The characters in a book don't always have to be people. As a matter of fact, I have some friends with me who were characters in a book that I was reading last week. The book was so good. Let me bring them out. I'd like to introduce them to you, okay? Hold on one second. Here they are. These are my friends that were in the book that I was reading last week. And look, they're not people, they're not human beings, they're bears. So remember, your character can be a human being or it can be an animal. What you're going to do now to start off is you're going to watch a Brain Pop Junior video and you will watch Annie and Moby learn and talk about characters. After watching the Brain Pop video, you are going to have a chance to take an early and easy quiz and make a character map. Don't forget, if you have trouble completing the character map, just go back, grab that book, reread it, and make a list of the character traits. Once you do that, it will really help you create your own character map. Don't forget to log into Clever to access Brain Pop Junior video. I hope you enjoyed learning about characters. Stay safe and keep learning. This is Miss Fields. Thanks for letting me be your guest teacher today. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.